Very quickly, let's talk part two of the spring summer 2022 Fear of God Essentials drop. Did I pick anything up? And a surprise Fear of God California hit my doorstep. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see. Yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and start. Everybody, it's your girl TJ back another video on talks with TJ and part two of the spring summer 2022 essentials drop was well kind of just sprung on us we didn't really have a whole lot of notice even if you watch Paul's video on locusts and wild honey he talks about not fully knowing this is dropping and um, again if you watch his video it's wild to see how some Paxon employees were behaving I get that they're following policy but no one's trying to buy like your first born child or something like they're not they're not doing anything wrong by wanting to get a feel of the items the material and then try them on i mean the fact that you don't have the ability to return or exchange it uh, t to me paxon go ahead update that policy think about the consumer <laughs> um in this situation that's another reason though also I'd say, hey, if you're able to shop on Essence, at least you can go ahead and return or exchange those items without a whole lot of hassle. I understand PacSun's reasoning just in terms of their, their exchange and return policy for fear of God items, but let's pull back on the way we're kind of handling the drops themselves. I'm, that's all I'm saying. The drop. Did I get anything in the end? Remember I said, hey, I have a lot of other expenses I'm focused on and this was last minute so did I want to just go totally off budget uh to pick the pick some things up did I have items I love yeah there are tons of items I love like I think I shared it on Twitter for the four items that were very important to me that was like a good 400 and some dollars and I just didn't want to spend that at this time but I still picked up two things so shout out to Wolf for actually being able to come through on these two items because uh his local Local packs on had them mine doesn't get anything but uh the track shorts for men and then also uh just a t-shirt i'm a big fan of the way the newer collars look so i want to test out the new t-shirt so uh, a t-shirt in the desert taupe colorway and then the track shorts in the black colorway or iron i should say for men so as soon as those items arrive of course i'll show you guys how they fit um i don't think you have to worry about anything right like very uh i guess in depth in terms of styling it's a t-shirt and some shorts i intend to wear these a lot during the summer months especially the black shorts just a staple go-to and while we're at it let's just talk about what essentials are supposed to be i don't think it's ever supposed to wow you right i think it's really meant to be the staples in your wardrobe no matter what you can throw on right a lot of us are not necessarily wowed by a t-shirt or sweatpants or a hoodie but we have our favorite items that we tend to go to or throw on if we have to run out and just you know run errands or we're lounging around the house or you actually just want to throw on a cozy fit that incorporates some of your your favorite things hey i also think it's based on just brands it can be based on your preference um some people will do the same with other brands like some people will wear all nike tech fleece and let me just say personally based on me owning it for a number of years i don't see the hype on tech fleece like quite honestly i i, I don't like after a while it just is what it is so I just think you have to keep in mind essentials was meant to just be something you can throw on every day mix into your wardrobe no matter what the fit is and go about your business <laughs> but um the drop itself so it went live on fearofgod.com as well as paxon and then essence so you had all three of those retailers at full go on thursday i was able to get in on fearofgod.com i didn't want to purchase from there i chose to just be patient figure out what i wanted to really do on friday and I'm still a little shook, but then not <laughs> that a lot of things are still sitting and available. Now, let me just throw this out there. I don't think that's a bad thing at all. I think it's awesome that items are available because, again, if you were somebody that wanted to 
test out the, the the brand just to see what it was all about you didn't really have that chance with the whole TikTok wave and everyone and their mom just wanted to throw on essentials even though they had no idea sometimes that it was linked to fear of God you didn't really have the opportunity to do that now you do so maybe there are certain items you just want to test out and not all of them some people are like hey I have other brands that I can get t-shirts from but maybe you really like the nylon item so you choose to go for those maybe you want more outerwear from fear of God essentials so you choose to go for that guess what now you have the opportunity to do that I also think some of the items are sitting just because because of again how it was just sprung on everybody so there wasn't time to build up to figure out what everything was it's the end of the month and let's just be real people still have bills to pay uh inflation is really taking its toll on a lot of households whether you know it or not and then also uh the fact that hey be real rent's due for people and if you've already got shoes on your wish list as well or that you're budgeting for and you're realistic that you might not get it for retail so you're planning to pay resale listen I don't blame you if you skipped on this drop. Um, so I think some people may circle back and figure out if there are items they want to go back for. Another thing, everything is so new too. So you don't even know how they fit. So for some of you that said, hey, I got the nylon nylon track pants, or maybe I want to try the running shorts, but you're not really sure how it's going to fit. So this is going to be kind of a trial and error thing for all of us if we get brand new items and then my last thought on some of the items being readily available right now past the initial drop date it's warming up so polar fleece and just a lot of the items that are dropping are meant more for fall and winter so unless you're stocking up for that you may not have intention to wear these for some time and so to think do i drop four and five hundred dollars on stuff i can't really wear right now immediately i'm gonna have to wait to wear you may have just decided to wait so um again if you hop on on essence you can shop menswear women's wear so many items are still available please keep in mind essence will have different names for their items and also different uh colorways so like they may call it a tan cotton jacket it's really i believe it's what the the, the barn jacket you have the tan jacket and uh that's actually called oak <laughs> just as an fyi but you have that jacket you have the storm jacket um looking they still have the denim coach's jacket a lot of the coach's jackets are gone just fyi we always know that's a hot item but browse around um let me just click real quick i believe a lot of the nylon pants readily available so if you wanted to test out the nylon pants go right ahead i have a very extensive wish list right now on essence uh i don't know i'm gonna fulfill some of those items so i still really want the women's oxford shirt i want a pair of the track pants i really like those and then again i told you guys i want more volley shorts or maybe even the running shorts for summer so i'll go back probably um uh, early mid-may to pick up some things but things are readily available so go ahead try them out again i'll have the track shorts in black and then the desert taupe t-shirt in terms of this surprise fear of god california that got delivered you guys remember when i ordered the almond colorway in a size 36 which is two sizes down from my true size 38 and it was canceled that showed up on my doorstep i'm not even kidding you i'm like unknown why is this here but yeah, it showed up on my doorstep. You already know, I'm checking accounts, I'm checking checking account, and I'm checking my credit card statement. I'm like, nothing's nothing's been pulled out. So I guess they went ahead and fulfilled it anyway. Listen, who am I to question a blessing, okay? So I now have the almond colorway. Again, the box never matches what the shoe looks like in hand, but think of it as just a darker tan colorway. Um, I intend to rock this all the time. I wear my Californias, let's just be clear i reach for those before i reach for a lot of sneakers these days i still think the 37 so that's one size down is the optimal fit at least for me personally so i have the the almond and the 36 because i wanted to test out oh two sizes down one size down one size down i think is the best way to go uh i can still enjoy the 36 in the cement colorway and in almond i just have to wear thinner uh super no-show socks and then that that allows me to get away with whatever so there are still a few colors i need right i still need cream i still need blush and i still need concrete so there are six total 
I got three, so three down, three to go. Very excited. Um, and I know somebody commented like, do, do yours not crease? No, like if you look very closely, they, or you might not be able to see it on camera, but there is a crease from where our feet just naturally bend. Um, mine is just not crazy pronounced, but you're, you're gonna have some crease somewhere over time. Um, the fact that it is just foam though, it, I mean, it, I'm fine with it. It's also very easy to clean. Oh, and shout out to Kusta, AKA Jock Slade on his brand new sneaker wipes with the new Republic. Public. so they sent a box over happy to have those listen those are great to just keep in your vehicle to store maybe in um, a, a bag a sling bag or something you know just keep them around to be able to quickly clean up your sneakers whether it's after a wear or before you're actually stepping out of the house so congrats to him always great to see uh, awesome people doing great things and you know listen that's something else added to his portfolio so thank you guys for tuning into this video please again comment below um, if you were patient, did you decide to finally go and pick up anything for the part two drop of spring summer 2022? Or are you just kind of taking it easy? You want to see how things shake out with, you know, we're heading into May. You have the uh, Mambasita uh, dropping on May 1st. So on her birthday or what would have been her 16th birthday. Very special. I know a lot of us want this sneaker. If we can't get it, this may be something where you just have to plan to pay resale or choose to not. Quite honestly, there's nothing wrong with you passing on a pair because you're not comfortable or you don't want to pl play the resale game. I have nothing but respect for that. Move on to the next pair if you have to. Uh, we just kind of have to control what we're able to control. But I intend to go for that and just stay tuned for more on the way. As always, extra age, not your shoe size. Peace.